and welcome everyone to the Sun Dried Bunnies podcast. It is I, So, your host, and in the co co hope co hope co op mm-hmm. chair, the co host chair this evening, it is the person who's tweaking the nipples of fear. It is Horror Queen Harley. Hello. She's got her hands working. It's amazing. Now, normally, we reveal our uh, our guest uh, just after about five minutes into the podcast, so we give them a big reveal. Instead, they've been sitting there quietly, gormless, uh, <laughs> because they are also <laughs> live at the moment, and we want to say thank you for our guest this evening, our special guest, Potatosaurus Rex. No, thank you, sir. Yes, Glad thank to be you, here. Sir. Yes. Thank you, sir. Indeed. Thank you for joining us here on the <laughs> podcast. I uh, appreciate You're that. Welcome, welcome into the streams. Uh, I am here and I'm over there as well. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, <wait. laughs> oh, what happened there? <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> Big potato. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Oh no. Sorry about that. Yes. Yeah, that's you absolutely say. fine. How the fuck was I not following? Hey, there you go. Potatoes for a potato. <laughs> if you're not following me, you can catch us. Follow, you can see us live over there as well. The first time the Sunshine Bunnies yeah. podcast is being dual streamed other than our previous co hosts. So actually, technically, it's not the first time. But not the first time for our guest. I'm babbling. Welcome, everyone. It's been uh, it's been a week <laughs> since we were last here when we had Dapper here. Uh, a wonderful guy, a wonderful guest. I hope you actually catch it. Uh, but right now, we have a guest that goes back a long way with uh, with both of us here, I think. It's, it's been well over a year that we I, I have known this fine gentleman. Potatosaurus Rex, <laughs> who the hell are you? I'm, I'm a potato. Uh, <laughs> well, I'm... Okay, so... Formally introduce. My name is Dale. Um, I've been streaming for just over two years. Okay. Around there, uh, started on the Isle. Actually, that was my first oh. streaming game, and that's what got me going. Really, it's been a blast. I absolutely love everything dinosaurs, as you can tell, yeah. and potatoes. Yes. 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 Your potato platoon is in full force. Yes. Uh, always. Yes, it is. Um, which, which, the first time I met you, I was like, oh, I've already got a potato, Harley. What are, you, what are you doing? I've already got a potato. I've already got a big potato. <laughs> I've got a big potato. I don't need him. Oh, this one's roast at the time. This one's a roasted potato. Yes, it's roasted a potato. Big, big or roasted. And I'm like, oh, well, let's find out. And uh, I've got to say, I was not disappointed. I don't know. On occasion, I'm sorry, big. Oh, I think I preferred the roast. I don't know what can I say. Every now and then, you want to need a bit of roast. Uh, yes, I agree. <laughs> How could you be so mean? <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're the one that portrayed by taking us to a different potato. But no, it was wonderful yeah. because actually, the thing the first time I, I, I blame you. <laughs> exactly. Um, um, but yeah, they blame you exactly. Um, so yes, the, the first time I met you, I believe everyone in your Discord and chat had, or at least in your Discord, had changed their names to potato names. Potato <laughs> themes. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Incredible. Oh, yeah. that's, 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 it was the best. Amazing. Um, yeah, just try to get everyone more involved into the yeah. whole like potato theme, you mm-hmm. know, make them feel more welcome. And then also I know, I th- you, I'm sure you guys know uh, Wabbit. She's been around for literally two years as well. Uh, right. She actually changed her Twitch name to Roast Wabbit. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Love that. Couldn't, couldn't find a decent picture though, unfortunately, uh, without being too realistic. <laughs> There's no oh, real drawings out there. <laughs> You get I'm a, actually still thinking of doing that, though. Yeah, uh, well, you, you get, you get yeah. to change your name, but then you have to stay with it for like three months or something, right? Is that right? Yes, it's three yeah. months, yeah. yeah. And it's been like that for well over a year. Ah, so that's good news. Yeah. Yeah. We, we, we found out how to change it now. Scottish Meatloaf, of course, who used to be Scottish Rick, that was never his name to begin with. Gosh. And then I said he looked like Meatloaf, so he changed his name straight to Scottish Meatloaf. He said, right, I'm stuck with this for three months. Never gone back. <laughs> everyone, exactly. everyone knows him as Meatloaf now as well. It's like no, you don't know like, yeah. anything else. <laughs> yeah, well, just pound the meatloaf. So I don't think I've ever seen him as anything else. It's, 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 it's strong branding. That is that strong branding. But I thought it was great because it was a good, good sign of a great community. When I was told about that, I thought, ah, so that's awesome. What a great place that uh, they'll oh, gather yeah. around and have that kind of camaraderie, as it were. Um, oh yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. No, absolutely. Um, but I, I first met you when uh, Harley, I believe, because I, I met Harley around, what was it March, April? Um, I think April, it was. I think. Yeah, I think and I, I, I don't think you raided very often um, at the time, Harley, because I think you were just meeting people. But the very first raid I think you did was actually to 
Potatosaurus Rex, and I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, it would have been. It would have been because he was one of the very first people Mm -hmm. I met here. Yeah, no, absolutely. Yes. And then I remember. I walked around. uh, Oh, sorry. Yes, continue. No, 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 it's fine. It's fine. Uh, I didn't get raided very often, so I was walking around. (laughs) Me and uh, and Potato figured this out the other day. I was walking around thinking that. That was my first raid for mm-hmm. so long, and then Potato's like, "No, I raided you." I was like, "What?" Yeah, it was. <laughs> you yeah. I remember. I remember. <laughs> yeah, mm-hmm. Jurassic World Evolution. You didn't have the microphone. <laughs> no, I did not. And I'm just stuck around. Yeah, it's been crazy ever since. It's yeah, been good though. That's that's the I same. Mean, it's the same game. Same game lot. as well. I, I yeah. came in with Val. Um, it was the same game, but I think it was her first stream, possibly the first stream that she actually had a microphone. Um, um, and I, 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 it was her voice that made me make it kind of stick around because yeah. I was on the verge of falling asleep. I was like, I'll stay for the raid, cool, so well. But I was literally in yeah. bed, as, uh, practically asleep when we came in for that raid, and her voice woke me up. <laughs> uh, so, okay. Spidey, Spidey, oh, was well. Spidey was there as well. Spidey was there. Yeah, Spidey was there. Um, so I guess welcome in, welcome in, guys. Um, yeah, no, exactly. So that, that was that. That was crazy because you, you, we hit it off straight away. You have such a great uh, on-camera presence. Um, you could tell Thank that straight you, away Thank because you. You, you've created an environment where yeah, stuff can happen at any moment. Like you, seeing you get jump scared is the greatest thing ever. <laughs> and they is. keep doing it. Even I've got to admit it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's the oh my god, I love seeing him jump scared. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> it's, 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 it, never, it never not catches you out. Like it will always exactly. get you. And I, I'm just mesmerized by that. That's what makes it beautiful because it's it's just. <laughs> It'll always get you because you get so immersed in what you're doing. Um, but oh, I have, yeah. I have yeah. seen it become annoyance as well, which I, I have to yes. say is also just as funny. Uh, <laughs> 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 I know, I know. You, you, if you're like a VC or even like, like I've just got, to, I've just got to take this, and everyone's like, okay. Then there'll be a jump skin. You're like. Like you remember, it jump out that screen. <laughs> yes. Oof. It used to be me that did that kind of shit to him too. Yeah. Really yes. hard, he couldn't get mad at me. Mm-hmm. He couldn't yeah. get mad at me. Never stay mad at me. It was so no. funny. Because I'd always do the knocking. I'd have all these oh, points pegged up dude. and the knocking gets him yeah. every time and it's the simplest simplest um sound, but he just it fucks him up every time. It kills me every time because it sounds like it's right behind you mm-hmm. and I'm, I'm sitting next to a window, so also in a way it sounds like someone knocking on a window and it's this side and that oh. side. And when I hear it this side, I kind of go, oh, for fuck's sake, god damn it. It's just freaking sound alerts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, no, I, I, I love Murder. that. It's, it, it's brilliant. Cause, uh, earlier on, earlier on today, was, I had a great moment. I was watching, I was watching Potato Sora stream and um, he was sitting there and it, 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 he, he sort of went a bit quiet. And then all we heard was, hello? And he's like, oh, god. what? <laughs> what? What is that? Was that a sound? I don't have a sound alert like that. Who was no. that? Who was yeah, that? I'm a, that's not a sound alert. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shitting my pants. I'm sorry, but I was so hilarious to watch because he was obviously in a VC somewhere <laughs> and he's in his server and forgotten completely. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so you don't even Jesus. have to use the sound alerts. You can get him in multiple ways, believe me. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean, when I when I did the um, horror streams for Visage. Uh, also, I had when I was in the VC, I had streamer mode on. So when someone joins the VC, you don't hear a sound. That's right. And yeah. there's a guy, Coco Jonas. He came in there and he just started going. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, <laughs> when you're walking down a dark corridor, clicking the camera to get the lights going, and you hear ghosts in the background, and mm-hmm. you just got the scream in your ear. The camera just goes flying all over the place, looking at the ceiling in the end. Absolutely beautiful, though. That, I absolutely love every second of it. That's one thing I need to start <laughs> doing to Harley more, because usually if I join I the PC so. when she's in there, I come in and start doing weird voices, but she knows I'm sort of like there, right? It's like I introduce yeah. myself, uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not jump scaring her, but I really should, I probably should just come, go in there and, you know. Put, you would too, put, like, put, I hardly speak to you half the time. time. Yeah. You should uh, just scream. Sh- End of story. Hey, yeah. buddy. <laughs> hey, doing Mozo. Hey, doing Mozo. Look at me. Um, so, so, how did you actually start streaming? Uh, now, two years. How did you get into this, this crazy game? Well, 
Hmm. I've always enjoyed entertaining. I've always enjoyed making people laugh, you know, and then also I've always wanted to show what I enjoy doing. And I played Isle for years and I thought the one day, let's let's try it. So I did it once and then I stopped for a long time. And then I don't know if you know, there's a streamer and a YouTuber, his name is Soviet Womble. So, I don't know if your name is a British guy. Yes, you introduced me to him. Yes, I yes. remember that. Yeah. He's huge. He gets millions of views on YouTube. He's got tens of thousands of followers on Twitch and all of that. And I jumped on his game while he was streaming. And I thought, well, stuff this, I'm going to stream as well. So I jumped on and I joined him in a game. It was his first time playing the aisle. So I was showing him everything and then oh. I got killed by Rex or something. Oh. And everyone in his chat was going nuts. They said, invite Potato back, invite Potato back. I was actually quite honored with hey. that. And then cool. people started finding me through that. And then also, because he's part of a clan called the ZF clans, uh, which basically means Zero Fucks clan. They don't, they don't give a damn what anyone thinks. I, right. I love it. And there's another guy named Sheep. Um, he actually was also playing, and I joined him, and I started a stream, and then he raided me um, uh. with, his, with his viewers. And funny enough, um, there's someone in my chat now named Fairy. She's oh. been there since that day, and that was like my second or third stream ever. Um, I don't see him here, but there's another guy named Berserk Chris. I'm sure you oh, guys know him. Yeah. I know Berserk. Also, straight from the beginning. Yeah, he's, mm -hmm. he's an absolute legend. He's been there since the beginning as well, and he's still around. So it's it's amazing. Yeah, I, I and it's just literally grown since that. then. I love how you channeled into that through through the aisle, really. You kind of owe it to that. Yeah. That, that's that's fantastic. Yeah. Just because you have that, that want. Um, did oh, you yeah. just go straight into it? Did you not like invest in a setup, or did you have all that already? Or... Uh, was it kind of I had a go thing. I had a very very simple webcam, a terrible microphone, and then as as I went along, saved up money, bought myself a new microphone, then headphones, then a better webcam, upgraded the PC. It just took, it literally right. took me until a couple of months ago mm -hmm. to get it to how it is now. Right. The most recent investment I have is the microphone. So. Right. Yeah, I'm getting there. Yeah. I'm getting there. <laughs> I, I love that. I love that progression as well because you can look back mm. on your kind of streaming career, or, oh, or as it were, and you can oh. see your growth, uh, if anything, which is which is wonderful. To look back on, if embarrassing, of course, yeah. for everyone else. No, it's just a, a microphone. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I had to sit this close to the microphone to talk uh, to people. <laughs> it's dude, it's I, terrible. I empathise with that. Yeah. I, it, I think many people in my early views will remember the the microphone being literally here and then the thing yeah that was it and that was that was me um then and, and i was happy yeah. like that it was crazy um but it took a lot oh, it yeah. took a lot for me to actually just remove the thing from away from my face and because mm -hmm. like, it came a safety net in a way it's yeah, like, it, it was. so used oh. to it yeah we were all really proud of you when you did that yeah, i appreciate that yeah, yeah that's neat well done <laughs> <laughs> and now I get to be yeah, that's... expressive and move around. You know, I didn't used to get to do that yeah. before. So. Yeah. Uh. yeah, I mean, everyone's got that little safety blanket, yeah. you know, like you said, yours is the microphone. I actually have a a, um, a spongy dinosaur, which oh. I used. I used to sit with it on my lap. It, it looks sure. kind of dodgy at first, but it's literally <laughs> a, a T Rex. Like right, it's a spongy okay. T Rex. Oh. This was my safety blanket. I always nice. had him like on my lap or something when I was streaming. Wow. From the beginning, it's weird. I know it's weird, but... That just, that my <laughs> sister used to have this pink thing that looks somewhat like a face in a pot, a black pot, and you used to be able to like mould it and push it around. It was like a stress Jesus. ball thing, but it was in a oh, pot. Well, it was it black was, magic. I don't know what that was now. I'm going to have to look it up. It must have been a British thing. And in Grand Ascot, kind of slime. It, I remember <laughs> five, no, it wasn't slimy. It was, it was really hard like rubber, but you could still mould it. It was really weird. But I remember Must we found it, it went stressful. moldy, so uh, we had to throw it away. Oh, no, but, uh, no. <laughs> so, Beautiful. Yeah, whatever it was made of, Delicious. volatile. Yeah, yeah well, it took off the shelves. Yeah, um, yeah. But there you go, that's, that's now locked forever in my memory and no one else, sadly. Um, so there we go. <laughs> but you've talked about you've talked about the aisle, and um, I think yes. that connection between yourself and Harley, uh, uh, you rated for Jurassic Park, I believe it was Evolution. Oh, um, so still the best movie ever made. You guys have <laughs> that connection with the love for dinosaurs. 
Um, yes. Yeah. Which which I now know you two. Obviously, your name is Rex now. But I like I I for a long time for me, you guys were oh that dinosaur duo on Twitch. They played the games. Yeah. You know, yeah. so, That's um, actually very true. Yeah. Where, where does your love for dinosaurs come from? Um, oh, uh, it's funny been, story, yeah. if I may yes, say. Well, funny, funny. <laughs> embarrassing in a way um when jurassic park came out when was it 94 95 93 no, 93 i believe 93 yeah i believe 93 yeah. okay so i was because still under age to watch yeah. yeah i was still under age to go watch movie in the cinema but um my uncle decided to sneak me in there so i go in there um, i didn't even watch the movie i was sitting on the floor like holding his hand not even looking at the screen because obviously the beginning's fine but when the big t-rex comes along and you are tiny you should you, oh, you will shit your pants yeah. yes rexy i'm sitting on the floor in the movie house watching the floor basically the back <laughs> of the chair <laughs> then a few years later about two years later um because here unfortunately when a movie comes out okay in america a movie comes out say january mm -hmm. in south africa it'll come out here yeah, in november of the oh. same year wow because it was just Back in the day then yeah. from from cinema to vhs i don't know if anyone knows what the hell i'm talking about sorry that, sorry i just got a raid i got a raid i got a raid hey adam welcome in welcome in. hey because the uh, the notification would have overspoke you there hey uh, how you doing adam welcome in well thank you so much for the raid how are you how are you welcome in we are on the sun drive bones podcast and we have been joined by particular rex and my co-host harley uh, she's going to put her weird hands up now to wave, I'm sure. No, I'm not. I turned uh, them off. I turned them off. <laughs> oh, you turned them off. I think she looks like a weird puppet. That's all. Um, You're supposed to You're a weird puppet. <laughs> Tadaro, hello. Hello, welcome in, welcome in. I appreciate that very much. Oh, I've played The Sims 4. What? Have you played that often, Adam? I have not seen you on The Sims before. Hmm, interesting. Oh, I see these weird hands. You want to so. see the weird hands? I don't know. Hang on. I don't know. If I had, they were, my, um... Do the hands. Do the hands. I had to plug it back okay. in. I don't know if it'll work. Oh, jeez. Like the lead version it. was getting hot. I find my love for building in video games. Uh, I played Minecraft for the first time a couple of weeks ago, and I've been in creative mode oh. going absolutely insane. Uh, so That's one game I still have not played as Minecraft. I, I probably will never one play it as survival, I but I love the. It's just really Lego. I love building it. Really Lego. It's just yeah, it's fun. Jeez. Um, yeah, excellent, excellent. Yeah. You got your arms working? I just plugged them back in. <laughs> Plug my arms back in. I just plug them back in, just man. Just what is wrong with you? <laughs> It's a normal thing. Got to be a like the only thing person to do, okay? To be fair, it's a thing that if, if you had been on the podcast last month uh, of Tetsaurus, you would you would be mm. joined. We would be joined as the only people not to have played Minecraft. <laughs> Unfortunately, you are now no. on your own. <laughs> I, I get to mock you now. <laughs> um. No, I would never. Hey, I would never. <laughs> to be fair, there's a reason I haven't played for so long. Um, hey, there we go. Oh, look, there's my weird puppet arms. Look, You're look. a weird puppet arm. Okay, look, it looks going through oh, you. Wait, that's you not right. What's that? What's going on? There? No, no, she's. That's why I turned them <laughs> off because she's going. She's going crazy. <laughs> so I'm going to You know, I'm already on one. But, um, I don't know if I'll get me open, but. Uh... Uh, who knows? Maybe one day. Yeah, it was fun till they clip through. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I uh, I need to I need to mess with where my leap motion is because it's going a bit nuts. My impression of Harley. Now, right? <laughs> 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 but the eyes are a bit more closed. We, we were we were just asking how Protectus Reflex got his love for dinosaurs, and he was on the theatre floor. Not looking at Jurassic Park in 1993. <laughs> yes, <laughs> um, yes, indeed. Painting a wonderful yeah. picture here um, <laughs> <laughs> of the floor. Yes, <laughs> the floor, yes. The a bit of popcorn at the top left of his vision. Yes, yeah. uh, <laughs> we've had yeah. the same thought then. Yeah. Um, <laughs> nice. So please, I, I, nice. I apologise for interrupting you there, but Adam, thank you so much for raining. Welcome no. in, everyone. Um, thank you for joining us here. Indeed, welcome, welcome. Yeah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so uh, about a year later, when it came out on VHS, uh, yeah, um, I actually watched at my my my, uh, my grandfather's house, and I have been fascinated by them ever since. And then when the third Jurassic Park movie came out with the Spinosaurus, I fell in love with the Spinosaurus. Oh, That's nice. my favorite dinosaur. 
and also was found in Africa, so that makes me really happy. Ah, uh, um, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, and then I actually got the uh, oh, how many discs? Is it? I think it's five or six disc Jurassic Park DVD special oh, thing, right? Okay, like collectors, which edition, had everything. Nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I even got that for Aliens. I got the non DVD disc Alien anthology. I got that as well. I collection. got that. Yeah, no. Alien anthology. Yeah, the one, yeah, the one that opens exactly. like yeah. this, and then it's like, that's the one. That's oh, the one. I've got the same one. Yeah, I've got that as I love beautiful, Alien as well. Oh. The guy, the HR Geiger documentaries and that are fantastic. Oh, and there's God, me sitting here with my Predator mask hanging on the wall. That's right. I'm sorry. 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 Oh, you can swear. We'll do it. Yes, we'll uh, Fuck. I mean, oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> You're fucking well. He wouldn't have me on here. He wouldn't have me on here if we weren't allowed to swear. Let's just put that out there, okay? Yeah. Good point. Yes, that's all. Ooh. Sorry about that. <laughs> So, I'm good. <laughs> has your has your love for dinosaurs ever extended into the sort of uh, historical kind of like real life love for them as well, or is it just oh, yeah. the media? I'm just curious because Harley very much oh, has no. always been very much the media based stuff. Because um, yes, it, yeah. it just stems from my love for a horror. But I, I just was curious mm. if you ever. If it, the actual re- dinosaurs are not just media. Well, again, no, I know, I know. I know but most of our conversations tend to, even when we had you on the podcast, went towards the media. Uh, so I'm oh, just yeah, curious yeah, I if, it, if, if, yeah. if you went the other way. I mean, the media is just brings it all to life. Yes. If you could, if you could yeah. put that. I mean, That's obviously, good. you see a dinosaur walking on the screen, or um, the thing is, like museums, we don't really have museums for dinosaurs here. So that's kills me because i want to go to a dinosaur museum so yeah and i've had all my friends go llama bastard uh he went to (laughs) one of these places and he just took about 150 photos and oh Oh. i am so jealous i i want to interact Uh, (laughs) i uh, I feel that i feel that we don't have uh, any real dinosaur museums here either that makes me so sad because i i want to go there and look at them we have uh like Australian like megafauna museums, but it's not like mm-hmm. dinosaurs. I still like that part like. though. Even the yeah, fauna yeah, fauna absolutely, is amazing. absolutely. We, uh, but we I want to go and like we, see dinosaurs. Yeah, we have dinosaurs here in our museum, so I'm gonna break your hearts. I don't even go and see <sighs> them. I don't even go and see them. I saw That's them once. Like, I saw them once. <laughs> I saw them once. <laughs> see them now. They're wasted there. They could have no. gone to you guys. They could have gone to you guys. You could join, but no, they're sitting here, and I'm not even looking at them. They're over That's there the behind me. It's unfair. It's just, I really want, like, like there's a place like, that you can um, order, like, you can get, like, spino teeth and, um, oh, no. like, as collectibles, like, real ones and fossils and stuff like that. I really want to get some. Oh, they like, real? I, I've me been too. tying them off we'll for share, a long time. Share links. Let's go. <laughs> I will. I will. They're not even that expensive. They're not even that expensive, to be completely That's honest. Weird, I though. really want to. In Morocco, actually, a dig site in Morocco. Yeah, so. yeah, Morocco up to Egypt because you've got the different Egyptus. Mm-hmm. What's it? Spin- Spinosaurus Egyptus is the one found. Yeah, Spinosaurus Egyptus. Egypticus. Sorry. Rikey. This is boffin. So, yeah. Damn right, Rikey, okay? I have a friend. I have a friend called Steve, out there, Steve. He actually goes on to the. Uh, 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 Jurassic Coast here, um, and he he digs uh, for fossils. He's found quite a few, and he's had offers to sell them to local museums, but he's refused the holding out. Um, so <laughs> that's crazy. See, I would so, do that. So I would. Cool. I would yeah, happily I do that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's it's yeah. wonderful. Um, yeah, the southern coast <laughs> of uh, the United Kingdom has a very hotbed for um, uh, for these uh-huh. discoveries. Yeah, whether it's washed up uh, stuff or just yeah. Crazy. Yeah, it's called the yeah. Jurassic Coast even because of the amount of activity. Yeah, so that's, uh, you guys that's had cool. one of my favourite dinos over there too, actually. So you've got like the Baryonyx over there. Oh, so, Barry. I fucking, Good I fucking love Baryonyx. Hmm. Yeah. I said it's similar, it's kind of related to the Spino in a way. Yeah, that's Spino and Barry is so absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. And they all oh, had feathers. <laughs> Let's not go there. Let's <laughs> not go there. Not go there. <laughs> That's still something which I'm a bit, I'm torn between. Okay, okay. I, I really am. I really Do you am think torn. It, is it because of the kind of ideal d- picture we have of dinosaurs being challenged? Because yeah, they're because of media. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm a fan of the Dionicus, to be honest. And he's like a 
feathery raptor, so I'm not like yeah. completely opposed to the it's... idea of dinosaurs yeah. having feathers. Yeah, it's it suits. To be honest, it suits certain dinosaurs. Uh, to me, it does not suit the Rex. I don't care what they say. Personally, <laughs> no, it doesn't suit the Rex. Very turkey dinosaur. It's the little me. arms that give it away. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's, like, <laughs> it's like little thingies there. It's yeah. clearly a bird. You know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you if you had a silhouette of a robin, right, and then a silhouette of a T Rex, if you zoomed that far enough, they look the same. I'm just saying. I, I, He's <laughs> <laughs> trying to fly or something. It clearly oh, had man. arms that it was not designed to have. It should have had wings. I'm just. <laughs> it, yeah. I mean, that would have been pretty badass, though. I'm not going to lie. That would have been pretty yeah. badass seeing a giant ass flying fucking T Rex. Fucking Rex. Fucking run for the hills there. Jeez. Yes. Uh, I was so honest, right? <laughs> That would have been badass. <laughs> um, but you, you, your, that love uh, of dinosaurs obviously transcended into the media. You think like, you play obviously play video games and stream it. Obviously, you mentioned the Isle, which yes. um, I remember coming to your stream on my own for the first time, and it was it was for it went, uh, when I worked. I worked perfectly uh, where you were on just before I went to work. So I was able to spend like about a good hour oh, to wow. ninety minutes with you, and I loved it because it was yeah. really peaceful. It was just what I needed before I had to yeah. go off and in, 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 into the bowels of hell. But um, <laughs> <laughs> um, no, it, it was wonderful. Was and you were playing these very tranquil sense. games, and you were explaining to me all the different dynamics of this this game and how intricate it is. Um, and basically, mm. you take a young dinosaur and you basically grow with it for its life cycle. I yes, until it's um, adult, and then you yeah. nest, you create, you know, you can. He introduced me to the Isle, actually. Yes, yes, I did. I did, yes. Named dinosaur after me. <laughs> oh, yes, because you designed the skin, because it's quite cool. You can oh. create a uh, palette, a like color palette. Mm -hmm. So. I just said choose two numbers between one and five and it'll be like two and four so i'll go two across and then four down and that'll be that specific ah, color nice. and then i would save it as harley or as uh, there was a guy named um uh another potato so i put potato, oh, potato so potato. yeah it was uh <laughs> every, it, yeah, they grow everywhere everywhere <laughs> <Of course. laughs> um, thank god <laughs> yes <Jesus. laughs> very true um but yes the the oil though is is it intrigued me because it was it was definitely something to relax and watch and I remember you actually uh, told me about this guy that you you'd mentioned on YouTube and I watched this documentary about game and, and everything uh, it, was, it, was, yeah. it was absolutely fascinating um, and I, it's one of those I never even was faced before so uh, it's interesting because it's been a simulation game um, do, you, do you have you played games that are not necessarily simulation but still have the dinosaur kind of motif to them like did, did you play like Dino <sighs> Crisis back in the day at all Oh yeah, I played Dino Crisis. Yes, okay. yes, okay. I, of course. I mean, come on, come on, man. <laughs> are, 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 yeah. you, are, are you number one? Is the best one? Because <sighs> mm. 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 see, why are you, why are you putting me on the spot now? You can't do this. To me. The first one, the first Dino Crisis <laughs> was definitely <laughs> <laughs> the first Dino Crisis was definitely yeah. Resident Evil with dinosaurs, which is absolutely yes. fantastic. Yes. But then when they went into That's the sequels, what drew me to it, yeah. Yeah, the sequel, the second one was definitely more action-based, just dinosaurs yes. shooting like crazy. Mm. Um, it, it didn't really yeah. have the kind of Resident Evil thing. And the third one went to space. So, um... It... <laughs> yeah, just don't, don't remind me, please. I, uh, the first one, <laughs> they're saying games, the first one's always the best one because it's the yeah. original, you know. Okay, I know they took it after the yeah, style of Resident too. Evil, but that's what I... Oh, yeah. Fuck, sorry. <laughs> uh, you, got, you can tell he got caught out by something over there. Thanks, Lama. This is the boss that I was telling you about. I told you I mean, to turn Lama. off your freaking thing. I did. Those ones are for bits, man. Stop the bits. Oh, dear. <laughs> the free ones. I shouldn't have said that. Oh, shit. Potato, dinos in space. Yeah. Um, <laughs> um, but, uh, another game more recently mm. that's adopted the dinosaur... Uh, Kind of well, sort of is the mechanical dinosaurs of Horizon. Um, oh, Horizon yeah. is that, Dawn, that, I think it's called. Yeah, I that's love right. That game. It's a new one for Forbidden West, but um, more so I the first. Played it yet. No, you haven't. Uh, is that I haven't played it, but I've seen it. <sighs> I want it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. No, that's, that's <laughs> farewell, <laughs> Charlie. Farewell. Um, yeah, because I mean, there's a whole bunch of uh, other dinosaur-based games. There's something called Beast of Bermuda. Uh, there's also Path of Titans, which actually was one of them, the guys who worked with the Isle, 
at a stage and then he left and he started his own company basically and started Path of Titans. Really, really well done though. They more also more the feathery side of things as well because right. you could choose feathered or non-feathered. So that's actually quite interesting the path that they took mm. compared to the Isle. Um, Beast of Immuna, personal opinion, it's a bit much because if you want to make a bright pink dinosaur with orange spots and you know and you can make one the mr bobby dinosaur i think was just described there oh my word (laughs) yeah it's it's crazy it's the colors are absolutely insane um i prefer the more realistic side of Mm. those kind of games because i love i even did a stream on a you could call like a role play um but a realism on the aisle when i played as the I better say the name right, I don't want to say the wrong word, the um, the Dilos, the Dilophosaurs, um, where I based it on actual animal behavior from African animals. So I based it on hyenas. So the female is the dominant and the males are the are the, um, the rest. Sorry, I just can't think of the word right now. <laughs> and that's how we played it. We didn't talk in game. We didn't use in-game so chat, missing. nothing. It was all visually done and I had the time of my life. It was one of my favorite streams, actually. It awesome. did so well, I um, loved it. Beast of Bermuda, uh, we, have a, we have a streamer we know called Cheese It. Cheese It. Um, Cheese and, it. <laughs> Cheese it. And she, she plays that quite regularly. Um, although she does go for oh. a big right back for about an hour. Uh, on occasion. <laughs> uh, so sometimes we, we forget that she's forgot. Uh, we think she's forgot that she's streaming and she's gone off to do the ironing or something. So, um, so we had we had to find Nadja. Imagine but, ironing. I just didn't. I didn't know if it was the game or something. Like she had to wait for that hatch. But I got very confused. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they got me. I like but, that um, one. <laughs> we do love our cheese it now, so anyway. Um, but that's, that's my only kind of connection with Beasts of Bermuda. It's interesting. I heard of the other one, the Titans one. That's, that's, that's oh, Path of Titans, yeah. Path of Titans. Now, the only yeah. difference there is you do missions to grow. So you've got to find 50 mushrooms, and then you get a bit of growth, and then you've got to go stop the dam from overflowing. So you've got to click sticks and take them to the dam, oh. and then you get XP. Or growth points. Right. It's it's a it's a it's a unique concept for a dinosaur game, but it's to me it's not realistic enough. Right. Okay. Like I said, the, the the Isle is a bare boned survival game. There's no, you don't even have to have a, a HUD on it. Um. There's no trying to find medicine because you hurt. There's no find a gun, find a weapon. Your weapon or your teeth. Mm. It's insane. You need water. Go drink the water. You need to eat. Eat the plant. Or if you're a carnivore you eat obviously another dino which is literally always another player so it's a pure pvp game the closest i ever got to having that sort of realistic um kind of experience was i Mm. played far cry primal and i took all of the hub completely yeah brave soul it was my first experience with the game i said when i was going to go into it that i don't want all of the thing and um Yes, that was painful. <laughs> um, but I will never forget the experience I had. But oh, it, oh I was so lost at one point, um, scared to death, being attacked by the saber tooth, <laughs> like running for my life in any direction, and then having to try and track oh, my God. way back was. Uh, when I got back, the, for, the the feeling of accomplishment I got was something beyond belief. I felt I survived, yeah. you know? <laughs> exactly. That's um, exactly how it feels. It really does. I oh, it's the best feeling in the world. Something like that again, an experience, something like that. It has a real immersion in a game. And it's, I find it mm. much more difficult to do nowadays. Because um, uh, uh, it, whether it's your time or anything like that, and my streams are known for being mm. very chaotic, so it's, it's <laughs> very difficult to go, like, <laughs> I'm, I'm immersed right now. Or, like, I, don't, I don't want yeah. to tell you a joke or a riddle or... <laughs> Well, why are you electrocuting yeah. me again, Harley? That kind of thing. <laughs> <laughs> um, hey, that was Shani. What are you talking about? Well, well, I, I, I don't believe him. I don't <laughs> believe him. <laughs> it was Harley. <laughs> oh, but, yeah. But yeah no, that, I have a just... habit of turning the I have a habit of turning the hat off when I used to do uh, like boss battles on Ark. So every time I would do a, like a big boss battle on Ark, I'd turn the hat off. That must lend itself well to that sort of immersion. Ark. That was another thing. Yeah. You, I, yeah. I don't think I've ever actually seen you play Ark, but are you an Ark player? Um, 
That's, uh, that's yes, what I yes, bonded with you. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah. That, that sort of makes sense. I'm sure you know conversations about it, but I don't think I've ever actually seen you play it. That's what confused me. Um, he hasn't so, for a while, actually. Yeah. yeah, I haven't played it for a while. Um, but for me, okay, Ark is, is, was one of the first, to me, one of the first, like, survival building games. So you've got to click wood, you've got to click stone, and you, you build up. And it just blew out of uh, uh, proportion, absolutely insane. Um, but to me, when, when I play a game like that, I like to take my time. So if it takes me a week to get from thatch to wood, let me take a week. But... When I play on a different server and everyone starts on day one, by day three, they're already at like the highest levels. And I'm st still sitting there with my little club, hitting, hitting dodos, <laughs> you know, type of thing. Yeah, I don't understand so, how they end up on the highest levels at day three if they're playing on official rates. Like, that's, that's, that's fucked. Like... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but even <laughs> because, I know, like I say with Berserk, he, he usually hosts uh, servers. So we usually play on those and he always names them like either potato something or berserk potato or something like that, which is quite nice. You know, even our, our, our aisle servers, um, it was called um, new friendly potatoes, you know, so it's things like that. Um, so we always try to base everything around potato themes and oh, man, I love him for that. He's an absolute beast. Um, but yeah, so we would jump on his server. So like your XP would be multiplied a little bit more. Your harvesting rate would be a bit higher. Yeah. But everyone would just fly through the the leveling, and I was always still there, just you know, <laughs> chip it away, <laughs> little caveman compared to yeah, I get else, that. You know? Yeah. So that's the way I play the game. Um, but it's still a fun game. When I when I get into it, I get into it. And right. I think, okay, I'm going to catch a bloody dragon today or a wyvern. And I will go and do it for the whole day until I freaking catch the bastard. I like that. So yeah, I, I I get really invested in games. I love sometimes. that meticulous gaming is is that that's an understated way of playing video games because I, I used to do that with puzzle games um, quite a lot. It would take me oh. months. So I'd keep coming back to the puzzle. I'm like, still stuck in this. It's fine. I'll come back again soon. Yeah. You know, I I, I would wait. Yeah. I'd just be very patient with it. Um, and I take my time and immerse myself as best I could, but I've lost that. Yeah. I've lost that love of immersion. But I, I like that a meticulous way of playing. So I'm going to do that, and if it takes all day, it takes all day because I'm going to have a good time. It takes all day. Like, it takes all day. I yeah. do that when I'm exactly. building. When I'm building on Ark, I, I like some. Oh of them yeah. Take, mm -hmm. take weeks for me to do like some, and I just I'm perfectly happy with that happening. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm perfectly yes, fine yeah. with it try to build a whole entire town in Ark on the, the Lost Isle map. We literally built a row of houses, we built a building, like as though it was a high rise and everything like that. It was called Potato, what? yeah, Potato Topia or something like that. <laughs> it was beautiful. And we took I still haven't played days that, to do it. Hmm. Oh, it's actually not bad, not bad. Last I've flown hours. over it, but I haven't, I haven't, uh, I haven't played it. Okay. I'm just trying out, you should. Just watch out for mm -hmm. the bloody crocs. Bastards. I'm Australian. I'm sure I'll be fine. I'll wrestle it. Yeah, you'll be fine. Yeah. She'll be alright, mate. She'll be alright. Oh, yeah, a little salty. Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> of course she will, yes. Get me to fight it. Yeah, um, she can take on a crocodile, but not a bloody spider. Okay. Well, that's, <laughs> that's exactly right. Would you rather take on a crocodile? She's got a priority straight. That's the main thing. Good. 100%. Yeah, so uh, are, are, yeah, you tied you guys together um, actually. Um, are we going to talk about because um, you raided you raided Harley, right? So that's how you met. Was that a random raid? I'm assuming. Um, what? Okay, this is how I do my raids. I always raid. No offense, Harley, but the people with the least amounts of viewers, oh, okay, nice. just to boost their numbers because. You can see if someone's an affiliate okay. or they haven't reached that stage yet because you need a minimum of three views per stream like average that's right uh, yeah. within the seven days you have to stream for at least seven days and have 50 followers so what i did is i think you literally had one viewer and i think it was yourself <laughs> no, it was gamma. 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 Oh, yeah. oh, it was a gamma she's gamma, yeah, it was gamma. for a while though. okay good gamma's been um, there for so, day one jeez that's insane mm -hmm. so i thought you know what i saw oh, okay cool um only one viewer i see you you're like because you look at the pictures and everything was meticulously perfect like there wasn't one tree out of place like you you had everything built in a perfect square and i thought this looks interesting so i, I went on and i watched a little bit 
then I obviously, then I thought, no, stuff, we're going to do a raid. And I decided to raid. And it literally went downhill from there. <laughs> <laughs> downhill, love that. Love that. I mean, he's yeah, not wrong, but, you know, you're not supposed to say it. Okay. Oh, yeah. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but then um, also then I think you joined the Discord as well. And then yes, we helped you promote your channel whenever you went live. We always shared it. Uh, we do that a lot in, in the Potato Platoon Discord. Mm-hmm. We, If there's someone that needs help getting to, say, affiliates, then we'll post the link and then we'll, all of us would go and just, even if it's just a follow if they're not live, yeah. and we would go follow them there so just to get that, that. follow yeah. target, which is really nice. I mean, we very much try and help everyone we can. And that's how we do it. That's, that's, that's wonderful that, because... You helped Harley get there, and then Harley has gone on with myself to do that for others as well. So, yeah, you know, yeah, you and you and Soul, you and Soul, very like very much adamant about pushing me <laughs> to yeah, there we go, pushing me to affiliate and. Uh, like you and Berserk, I remember actually you and Berserk went around fucking telling everybody to go over. <laughs> Literally everyone we could find. Because <laughs> <laughs> you, we really wanted to help you out because you were, you were mm. actually very genuine um, in your streams as well. You know, um, I don't know there was just something about you that just was real. If that makes sense, I don't know if that makes sense. Like the, no the way that you played, <laughs> apart from that, apart from that, like, the way that you played your game, you played it to its full fucking potential. You know, like you try to squeeze every single dinosaur on every single little block of land on the, that one map, <laughs> literally. It, it, and I found that fascinating. I was like, Jesus, you really put everything into this. You're trying to do as much as you can, and yeah, I that it. I think needed a push because you can share that with everyone because I thought you're building the way you built things was just it was awesome me I'm just you know he has a triangle enclosure he has a rectangular one with the, <laughs> with the because I need to put a, a power station or something and it was a complete mess <laughs> but that's me I <laughs> a complete mess cheers <laughs> <Yeah>. cheers to that <laughs> um, but yes look, look at Harley now she's a hot mess yeah. So um, I am definitely a hot man. Should we? I suppose talking about the three of us. Should we briefly talk about the this ill-fated Discord that we created that lasted uh, only about a week or two, or should we move on from that? No, let's move on. Move on from that. Okay, no worries. No worries. So you yeah, leave that. You mentioned. Um, you mentioned. <laughs> you little shit. That's me. <laughs> <laughs> forget that interesting. <laughs> so, you mentioned oh, we were talking about um, the dinosaur games, uh, role playing, and you role playing yes. on the aisle, and that's something you've been doing yes. um, very recently. And you've introduced me to um, is your role plays with Red Dead. Um, and I think you've oh. dated Grand Theft Auto as well, I, I believe. Um, if, Which you one's have, uh, have you dated Grand Theft Auto as well? Graphic Auto Fine. You haven't done a role play there, but I think no, you have, I haven't you done that one yet. And then you did Red I've Dead played too. it. I might be just yeah. connecting the yeah. two there. But yeah. the yeah. role playing Red Dead is, is fascinating me um, when oh you're on it, uh, and you're definitely invested in it. It's it's amazing to watch. Um, you have you, no idea, dude. You have how, no idea. How did you get into the role play? Can you explain what it is for people who are not quite familiar? Okay, so basically, role play is putting yourself into a character. So you you create. A person with a completely new background you can do an accent if you want um, and, and you basically live this person's life in a game so like for example in GTA um, <laughs> sorry <laughs> Wabbit just did a face there um, <laughs> so basically um, so like in GTA I know there's this one server where when you start you have to do a driver's test before you can get a car then you still got to buy the license plate you've got to buy petrol you've got to eat you've got to drink you've got to do everything right it's insane yeah. red dead is very similar to that as well except you don't need a horse license to, to, get, to get a horse you know so but <laughs> you literally true. start off with well you know it depends on the horse i suppose you know uh, but <laughs> so basically um you create a character like i've got I created a character named uh, uh, Butcher Smith. He was the one character I created. 
Then Wabbit and myself, we decided to create these once-off characters. A lot of people get, I suppose, because if you type it in Twitch, it counts it as a profanity and it wants to block it. But basically like a hillbilly dial person. Oh, okay. So he's got like the straw hat, he's got the overalls, a classic, classic look. And we actually use a voice changer to change our voices to a bit higher pitched than what we speak now. And this character became more than a once off. It actually became the best character I've ever created in my life. The the accent actually pops out when I'm at work. <laughs> oh really? I love that. I have invested into this character. Brilliant. And I can see Sol doing Jesus. that at work. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I actually think Sol, you would absolutely love it because I know you you can do so much. You could create such an amazing character. But you can be a hunter, you can be a lawman, you can be a criminal, a farmer, also bounty hunter if you want. You can be a yeah. whole bunch of things. Yeah. It's beautiful. And the community that we're with is actually such a good community as well. The only bad thing are the queues that you wait to get into the server. Because ah, you can only have so many people on. Mm -hmm. So at restart, that's when you jump in. Oof, it's insane. But it's like the character I created now, his name is Rufus. Uh, but his friends call him Rufy, you know, so it's it's quite a play on words there. It was quite a quite a nice little swap there. And Wabbit is my cousin. <laughs> cousin. Cousin. My cousin. 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 Darlene. Darlene. <laughs> Darlene. <laughs> you got to understand by seeing the characters. Uh, they're absolutely brilliant. Uh, oh, you can also be a blacksmith, a logger, a tiller, a priest, a doctor, a lawman, an outlaw. And those are just okay. some of the jobs. So I've got right. Bunny in here. Uh, I met Bunny. She jumped into my stream while I was doing role play. Ah. And she's actually been so helpful with what's going on. But the only the sucky part about it is if you stream, you might get people that are meta gaming. So meta gaming is basically a Call of Duty's uh, stream sniping. So if I'm doing something illegal, let's say for example, I want to go rob a bank. And I'm telling everyone on stream, okay, guys, I told my team, okay, we're going to go rob a bank um, in St. Denis. There might be lawmen, obviously, hearing this because of the stream. Right. And they'll actually go wait for you, which uh, does happen, right. which sucks. So I've got this screen, it's called being naughty, no look, no, don't look, being naughty, or something like that. So when I'm doing something like, for example, you actually get something called swamp weed, which is basically like marijuana, oh, and you can roll it and you can sell it, but no one's allowed to know how it's done because the recipes are unique and only certain wow. people know the recipes. I know the recipe, so yeah, <laughs> you know, things like that. So- He looks so proud of himself when yeah. he says that. Yeah. I know the recipe. Yeah. Smart. What can I say, you know? Um. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, yeah. So it's things like that. And then there's also recipes for food and you have to eat, you have to drink. There's a recipe that people are trying to get hold of that not many people no, it's the goulash. Now, I have to put up the screen every time I make it so no right. one on the stream can see it. Gotcha. Otherwise, everyone will know and they'll have to change the recipe to something else because it's all sorts of mods and everything that's put onto the server, which makes it realistic. It's interesting. beautiful. Sorry, I could I could talk about this stuff yeah, for hours. I love it's this. Fascinating. It's fascinating. It's like entering yeah. another world. Um, it is. And that's, well, that's, that's amazing. Hello, hello, Chloe. Hello, welcome in. Um, no, that's that's, that's I fantastic. Know. I found it. I found that so interesting that again, it goes back to that level of immersion as well. So you're not just immersing yourself in the game; you must yourself into a role while playing the game. And earlier on, I saw you digging for gold in what can only be described as one of the most well Pretty done fish. voices I've ever heard. Um, oh, you made this one. This, yeah, this is this is Rafi. That, that, what, that's it. That, that voice this is Rafi. Yeah. Yep, I use this voice all the time. So, with the voice changer, unfortunately, like the guys in stream will hear the voice as well. But in game, it's it's beautiful. Everyone just like I'm such a unique character. Well, Darlene and myself are such unique characters. I think we spent three hours working on just a once-off character, which turned into a so many people know who we are and it's it's beautiful it's yeah it's amazing 
I absolutely love it. So, so yeah, so this is very, very space, bit funny. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you put on like an American accent or, um, I mean, there's a lot of guys that are, are, are British. Um, the one guy, Stan, um, he's British. Uh, there's French, there's Spanish, everyone. There's even a South African guy who speaks with a South African accent in the game. <laughs> and it's accepted. That's what I like about it. And the interaction with people, I could be riding on a horse and be like, howdy, and someone would be like, howdy, and you start a conversation. Yeah. So what's your name? I was like, my name's Sarah, and I'll be like, my name's Rufus, but my friends call me Rufy. Like, that's the way I introduce myself, and people mm -hmm. remember that. Yeah, I've just absolutely. invested so much. I'm going to take this freaking voice, voice yeah. change around. <laughs> that's all right. Don't worry. A big potato. This is a very voice change to work. Big, like. yeah, big, big potato. Yeah. If I did the American accent in a role play, no one will ever want to talk to me again. That's that's the. Try it. Let's hear it. Let's well, hear well it. it's not okay. So the American it's accent, American the, big, accent the American accent, the big potato is talking about is actually a character from the show Red Dwarf. Which is a sitcom. Red Dwarf, Red Dwarf. Yes, yeah, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's okay. that, I've that never there. seen it, but I know of it. It's yeah. at the back of me, uh, in my head there. That's Red Dwarf there, and uh, the robot character there. He has a very odd American accent. Uh, so I, I can do the impression, but for some reason, potato thinks that's my genuine American accent. Okay, so he he speaks like this. Okay, oh hello, sirs. I'm American. Howdy, partner. Um, so it's very, it's that's, very much like that's that. That's pretty damn but good. I don't know that, but if I was doing an American voice, I wouldn't do that. So that's just Crichton from Red Dwarf. I love the face that Sol makes when he does oh, it hello. too. Like he makes <laughs> this face when I he does it. <laughs> I actually have the mask of him here. Because um, I, I uh, recreated episodes well, of Red sorry. Dwarf. So Can I redeem <laughs> something called Wear Mask or something like that in your... I can't wear the mask. I can't wear the mask. <laughs> put it on. Put it on. <laughs> what have you done to me? What have you done to me? <laughs> yeah, the ultimate role play here. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, so last you've seen me for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Hartley, what have we done? Why, hello! <laughs> Howdy, <Where's Tony>, partner! <laughs> this is just my life. I'm, not... <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. Have you got I'm any of that marijuana? <laughs> marijuana. <laughs> yes. Oh, this is beautiful. So, so I can't, I can't, this is role play, so I can't stop doing the voice until I take off the mask. Keep it on. So, <laughs> I'm going to have to. I'm gonna to have to just uh <laughs> Jesus. And then I'm back this in the is, room. Is... Um... Oh my god, where did he go? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it's gone! <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> So the roll <laughs> that happened. Um, so <laughs> <laughs> the role play <laughs> um, how do you manage <laughs> the to stay in character? while you're also streaming and having the whole interaction with chat and the sound alerts, yeah. how do you manage to balance all of that? Sound alerts, um, I usually say there's someone screaming in my ear. <laughs> Cause I can be busy talking like, like okay, so we're gonna go do some farming and this guy just screams them like, oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> like that's all I say in the accent <laughs> as well. And I don't know what the hell happened and I realized it's a sound alert and it was like, are you okay? <laughs> like, yeah, just someone screaming in my ear. <laughs> so I, I use, yeah, I use the sound alerts yeah. in the... <laughs> So I use the sound alerts to kind of enhance the character, but so people can see it's a little bit. I mean, if you if you look at him, you'll see what I mean. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's, a, he's a yeah, he's a <laughs> classic. So, but he, oh shame. So, how can I put it? I still speak normally when I speak to chat, but sometimes it comes over to chat as well. So, um, so like Bunny now said, those voices you hear, like. Those are the voices that I hear. I'd be like, "Yep, I hear those voices all the time." But I'm talking to Chad. Right. But I'm talking as Rufy. Mm -hmm. So it always it, it it blends in with everything I do. And most of the time, I actually speak in that accent when I'm playing Red Dead, especially when there's a lot of interactions happening. I just let it fall over. But usually, if someone say follows or does something, I usually automatic just goes back to my normal accent. I had a bit of a moment. Swan on my Batman stream the other day because I'm I Batman. yeah I have I have a redeem <laughs> called Two Face and I will when it's redeemed mm -hmm. I will I go down and I'll reappear as one of my characters um, and I came up as a, a Potato's boyfriend Radical Ralph 
Uh, big Potato's boyfriend, not Potato. your boyfriend. Your <laughs> boyfriend. Um, yeah, your boyfriend. Oh, it could be everyone's boyfriend. <laughs> and at that <laughs> moment, I did the character, and then I got raided, and it was a random raid. So I had to oh. quickly <laughs> drop the character to my, uh, and just move on quietly. <laughs> Okay, the less we see of Ralph, the better. It was fine, so I'll <laughs> I did another yeah, character. You went, out of the screen. you went another character, and I, I brought in Boulder, the manliest man that ever did man, and you electrocuted him, Harley. <laughs> That's because he is fucking terrifying, so. Okay? <laughs> he is a terrifying, hairy bastard. Okay? <laughs> yeah, he's got a big, wow. big, big, bushy beard. Yeah. He's a, hey. He is a hairy bastard. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know what... Um, Hey. I'll, I'll, I'll go get the beer. Yeah, no, yours is fine. His was his oh. is, is horrifying. Don't bring Bob. Oh, I can't bring it down. I'm gonna get there. Oh, so. Oh, stop, stop it! Stop, stop, stop it! it. Like, uh, hey, hey, you just a code. I'm, I'm, I'm the guest. I want to see this shit. <laughs> oh God, I want one. Oh my God! Of course you do. <laughs> well, since we're doing that. Oh my god, what have we started? Where has this gone? Oh no! <laughs> Whoa! Hey, howdy! Oh. oh no, he's doing the voice. I'm oh, the I'm Boulder, the manliest man that ever did oh, man. <laughs> oh my <No>. god. <laughs> it's now, it's I, so I, scary! I, I'm looking, I'm looking at the screen. And I'm seeing a very manly man. Oh, that's my reflection. Hold on, that's me. Oh, over here. There's another one. There's another one. Hello. Hello. Who are you? I like the horns. How dare you call me a manly man? I like the horns. <laughs> oh, we got another one. We got another man. Sorry. I, I knew he was going to do that to the bastard. <laughs> so, yes. What do you, what do you think about it? How manly oh, I am. Yes. I love it. I'm, I'm grey man to that length now. <laughs> it's taking a while. I have to make sure that I don't lean back, otherwise all I can see is hair. That's the only problem. That's all I can I refuse to cut it. Do it again, just, just do it again. <laughs> People mistake me for a seek, but no, it's just a lifestyle choice. <laughs> it's just a lifestyle choice. But only a man can grow a beard like this, is what I'm saying. I don't see any woman do that. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm dying. Oh god, I'm dying. I'm with you. <laughs> Why am I liking this too much? Oh, yeah. god. shave me. Oh, yeah. oh Jesus. Oh. And I'm back in the Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, my Was it the god. same person? Oh my god. <laughs> Where's he gone? So Where did he go? <laughs> So I do a bit of role play myself, is what I'm saying. That's what oh I'm saying. Very I different way. So well. I, I nearly died. So well I, I need Where's my water? It's my teeth. It's my teeth that ruins it. Yeah. No, but, but just, the, just the, like the, the way it opens, and you just see this. I've, I've died. I absolutely died. Thank you, sir. Thank no, you. No, no, oh no. man. I should be like, I should be like, yeah. Oh my God. Uh, Say so, yes, your role play. Um, <laughs> it is fantastic. Yeah. How do you see it growing? Like, um, do, do, or like, does Red Dead constantly get updated? It's, it, I'm assuming you, you rely a lot on mods, perhaps, in, in a way. Oh, there's yeah. tons of mods on there. How? Okay, so at the moment now, you could call it at its peak. Obviously, new updates, it'll be at its peak. So at the moment, like like I say, if if I'm getting bored of what I'm doing now, I can always go to the law and be like, listen, I want to be a police officer or what you call about a sheriff or a right. whatever. So there's always something you can do, um, and it's kind of sad. Your horses can die from old age, oh, no. <laughs> and we had quite a a, a sad moment when one of our also calling my cousin, his name's <laughs> Ken, <laughs> his horse died. And we were all crying in the game, but I think he really got emotional oh. about it, which can happen. Why would um, crazy attachment? I know, I, I know, um, I know. A lot of people can get extremely invested in it. I mean, I'm super um, invested in this. So, if, for example, let's say uh, Wabbit, her character Dolly, my cousin, let's say she died because 
let's just say for example she can't play anymore so the character has to die in game right um gotcha. something will happen there's probably a good chance i will literally like oh. bore my eyes out you know what i mean because we've invested usually when we play together we are one hell of a team it's the weirdest thing ever but i think because of how we created the characters being cousins and always being there with each other like i can be on and she's not and i'll play a little bit differently to how i do with her mm -hmm. if that makes sense and we just make the most random couple inverted commas mm -hmm. like a team sorry yeah. with this group that we met and they accepted us with open arms because they absolutely love our characters and the way they are and that's what makes it so much fun um i have i think i've just rambled off there a second but yeah i, I don't know why i'm rambling I, if, yeah. <laughs> if the um <laughs> if the community or a subsection of the community found uh, the, the into the role play thing found another game do you find do you, do you see yourself actually continuing the role play uh, in, into other other games and other genres perhaps uh, oh other... yeah Oh, of course, yeah. I mean, there's actually quite a lot of games. Survival games are usually the best ones to do it in. For example, sense, yeah. uh, Daisy, mm -hmm. or, um, Seven Days to Die. They can, you can always make a story from a character. You can add mods on literally everything these days. So you can add a farming mod on Daisy, for example, and you can farm potatoes. Um, so you can be a potato farmer and everything seems fine. Next one, this guy comes up to you and starts attacking you. You don't know why. You as a real person knows that it's a zombie, but your character doesn't know it's a zombie. So you've got to play it as the character, not as you, you know, the streamer yeah. or the gamer. But you play the character in game, so he's oblivious to a zombie apocalypse. So when he gets hit, right. you fucking run for your life and you know not to go near something like that again. Mm -hmm. So and then your character builds as things happen. Right. So you think, okay, now I'm getting hungry, I need to eat, let's look in the fridge. Okay, there's an apple. Okay, now I know. I can at least loot places to get food or water or so plates or whatever. The character has to learn, yeah. even if you've already, as a gamer, know what you're doing. The character has to learn. Yes. That's that's a level yes. of role playing commitment. I I can I can admire yes. actually. Yeah, that's dedication. I think, like I say, I think you will do brilliant in role play. I think you could be a. a I don't think what you could be in Red Dead. You could actually be a an outlaw. You could oh, be quite well. a funny outlaw. Yeah. Well, I am a bit of a maverick. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. A bit of a That's renegade, am I right, Harley? Yeah? If you sure, could uh, see sure right, the sure. look on my face right sure. now. <laughs> 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 all right, all right, all right. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. But, um, Holy Jesus. What, what mm. if you get troublemakers that come in and just start shooting everyone? Oh, then, then you get the law involved. So, like, the law will come and shoot them down and arrest them and throw them in jail. Like, right. there's a literal, you can literally throw them in a jail. And then everything happens out in, in the Discord. So, there's literally laws. So, if you shoot someone and you just wound them, you get a fine of, say, $75, you right. know, type of thing. Um, or And there, there's even a prison. It's called Sisica. It's oh. actually an island off the main map where you can get shoved in there and you have to do manual labor for oh, so many wow. days. So there's a whole, so cool. there's an actual system behind yeah. everything you do. But if you escape, just make sure you escape for a long time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because they're going to find you. They, they will. You that's, so, that's so cool yeah. that you use the tools of the game to build not just like stories in the work, but you create something mm. even more, especially with the addition of mods, I'm sure you can... You, oh, the sky's yeah. the limit, I suppose, in, in that regard. Oh, yeah, 100%. Oh, the sky's definitely the limit. It's, it's, I mean, I saw a bloody hot air balloon the other day, and I was like, what the fuck is that doing <laughs> in the sky? And Ruthie Brilliant. wanted to shoot it down with a gun. He didn't know what the fuck was going on. A man's flying, what's going on? You know, type of thing. It was, you, you, you live the character from 1900, so you don't talk about, oh, hang on, my phone's ringing. You know, no, yeah, there's no. none of that. And... <laughs> And if your phone, if someone's phone like rings while you're busy talking in game, it's like, what kind of whistle is that? You know, so <laughs> try and incorporate what is this the devil music. Yes, yeah. sort of adopt these things if you need to kind of cover yourself. You, you improv, uh, which I think is obviously exactly. improv. You know, one of my special yeah, improv specialty. is a huge part of yeah. role play. Improv oh, is thing. massive. How you're, how do sorry? you handle the awkward conversations or the? The awkward engagement. Someone who's not as experienced to know what they're doing. How did you yeah. adapt to that? 
Yes. Um, I think about that question for a second. It sounds like you're yeah. asking him about birds and the bees. I was like, what? Well, okay, well, when a man loves a woman, <laughs> so um, when you get to that conversation, like, for example, you go, how are you? And the person's like, hey, how are you? And you'd be like, I'm good, and you, um, good, thanks. And then that awkward silence. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so what you do, and you just, you, you, you kind of try and push a conversation until right. it tapers off to maybe this guy can actually help you in the future to be like me i don't like this guy i'm gonna go well enjoy your day cheers have a great day but you, you um as shadow says you, you play it off you you just try and interact um uh, people who play the role play want to interact that's the yeah thing. that's that's probably um, the, the most it's not like a guy thing. who wants to come in and be like okay i want to role play but I'm, you know hi Okay, bye. You know, they want that interaction. They want to grow their character with every conversation they have. I mean, apparently my, my character killed an, an alligator by poking his eyes out with these thumbs and drowned it. I don't know how that came out about, but apparently that's what I've done. Right. <laughs> that's <laughs> the backstory of my character, you know, and that's just a silly example. But you actually get to know people in game and you remember them. So I'm walking and I'm like, hey, is that Rufy? And I'm like, who's calling me? And I don't know who the hell it is. <laughs> I've spoken to him about five times, but because they changed their clothes, I don't recognize Oh, of course, It's, yeah. it's things like that. I yeah. know oh, it's me. It's, it's it's Alice. It's Alice here. Yeah. Right. Oh, it's Alice. Yes, I, I remember you. How you doing? You know, things I like, like that. that. I like that. Um, it says a community yeah. in there as well, right? That's, that's yeah, yeah. transcends the game, I suppose. Yeah, well, that's and like cool. certain things you say, you know, carries on to each character. So my way of saying howdy instead of howdy, I go howdy with the extended wire and it goes high pitched. That's my way of greeting and people hear it and recognize that voice. That's good. And they know, ah, okay, Rufus is here or Rufy's here or whatever. So, it makes you know, stand you, you, out you, like that. Yeah. you stand, I, 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 I think I stand out a bit too much because if oh. I want to become, say, a, a criminal, and they say, "Oh no, it's the guy with the high-pitched voice." They'd be like, "Ah, okay, it's the it's the cousins type of thing." So that's the sad part. So you've got to be so right. careful. <laughs> uh, Panda likes me some RP as well. That's, that's interesting. Panda. Have you ever streamed any roleplay, Panda? Let me know because I, I I don't recall you doing it. But I know someone did Grand Theft Auto recently. I can't remember who it was in, in roleplay. I thought it was yourself, but it wasn't. I know you played GTA, but you weren't you weren't roleplaying it. Um, oh, that's gonna hmm. bother me. Uh, now, now, one of the things. That, <laughs> hey, oh, hello, Shahira. Hello, welcome in. Hey, welcome in. Um, hello. Uh, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Hello. I think you've got to admire Shahira. Oh, uh, <laughs> uh, well, Shahira is actually uh, South African too, uh, and she's living oh, living, living in the UK. Um, Has it? Uh, Has it? Yes. Has it? So, uh, oh, is that is that official <laughs> greeting in South Africa? How is it? Yeah. Do? Okay. How's it? Yeah, how's it? It's like, oh, okay. how is it, but shortened. Right, okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Just that, that just the timing on that was just, yeah. yeah it's, it, you are from the same place. So, they, yeah. <laughs> just point that out oh, now. Okay. Um, no, that's it, Brie. Like, like it's good at shoot. Uh, straight out of <laughs> Joburg, how's it? Yes, there we go. Yeah. Oh, how's it? Straight out of Joburg, me too. I actually oh, love Shane oh, really? accent. I really do. Oh, yeah, very <laughs> nice. Okay. So, you can actually it's all the best. Mm -hmm. Awe. Awe, my second. <laughs> so that means awe, uh, it's like, how's it, mother's child? If that makes sense. <laughs> my oh. second. Wait, that, that sounds a my bit too close. Mother. Wait, mother's child. Okay, okay. Yeah, no, I know what you're thinking. No, because the two, my brain went two ways. Oh, it wait. went. It went motherfucker and uh, son of a bitch, and I didn't know if you were, wait. What happened to my brain there? Like, what okay, I just did. Uh, <laughs> you, you want to learn a classic? I'm sure you guys. Yeah, I just thought he said cunt. You know me. <laughs> well, that's gaunt. Again, I can't. Um, oops. Um, <laughs> um, there's another one which is a lovely insult, and I'm sure you guys know this if you know South Africans. Is your master pools? <laughs> <laughs> If you want to insult someone, you say that, and you will get blixumed, which means you will get beaten. I love it. Oh. Say it amongst friends. It's, it's all good. We're, we're, we're learning a lot today. I know that one. My brother from another mother. <laughs> yeah, brother from another mother. Bra from another bra. Joiner from another That's, that's her number one fake insult. There you go. Nailed it. <laughs> like the house is on fire yeah. as these two, two, two entities collide here. Uh, Sorry, I got a bit uh, carried away there. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> um, 
So yeah, so out, outside of um, of gaming, you do do some other mm. activities, and recently you've even streamed. You doing some other activities? I've seen you uh, barbecuing. Um, yes. I've seen you on a oh, boat. That's fun. You know, a boat as well yes. what are you doing on a boat oh, I loved it what are you doing out there yeah <laughs> you know well um, just take, take your why phone why aren't you on a boat okay I think that's the deal <laughs> okay we were looking for hippos and crocodiles oh, so, nice. and we actually found them so that was good um, I literally oh. streamed the whole trip from the start all the way down to the hippos and then all the way back I saw a lot of the passing vistas and I thought this looks beautiful mm. uh, but I, yeah, I didn't beautiful I didn't, know, I didn't get to see the, the catching of them oh that's wonderful oh do you have a favor? It, that place is called St. Lucia. It's actually a wildlife heritage site, so it's protected. There's no fences. Um, they say don't walk around at night, not because of the people, but because of the hippos. Hippos oh. have been seen walking the streets of St. Lucia. And oh. it's literally on the ocean. And there's an estuary that goes into the ocean that's all natural. Um, and crocodiles have been seen in the ocean, and the hippos have been seen in the ocean as well, like with the, within the waves. It's mind-blowing i've seen the video it's one, of those things, it's one of those things actually people don't realize is uh that crocs do swim in the ocean like people yeah don't, they do people don't, I know, yeah I know. people don't get a people don't realize that they're like no i'm in the ocean i'm safe from a croc no <laughs> no yeah, right. <laughs> and, and the best part is there's no there's no lifeguards there there's no safety net so literally it says swimming aloud, but at your own risk it shows a picture of a hina hippo croco crocodile and sharks so you've got four things to contend wow. with in the ocean. And I thought I'd be safe in my own home. A hippo's the scariest hippo. Imagine walking into your house, there's a hippo there. Help it's safe to your fridge. Yeah. You know, I've heard they're, dead. they're really deadly as well. They kill a lot of people. They are, yeah. Oh, they are. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, they, they actually were considered to be part of the big five. And you know what the big five is, right? Like lion, rhino, um, soul. Oh, buffalo, soul. Oh, no, <laughs> <laughs> since then. Se seven Harley, uh, <laughs> eight potatoes, just in general, potatoes in general. Yeah, but they've got the big five. The reason why they're called the big five is because they are the most dangerous animals to hunt. But yet, croc, um, but yet hippos actually more dangerous than than nearly everything out there. It's killed more people than any other animal, basically. The reason why it's not part of the big five is because they water none like 23 hours a day. So they're literally like shooting fish in a barrel. The big five is an actual hunting term because they the big five are the most dangerous animals to hunt. Uh, oh, I, see. <laughs> I like I said, I'm an animal enthusiast. I love animals. Oh, yeah, I even got the, the lion paw on my wrist. Nice. I wanted this real size, but then it'll literally be about this big. Oh, uh, so right. Tattooed. <laughs> maybe my ass, but. Well, maybe uh, that's a reason to work out, maybe. <laughs> You know, get your arms yeah, bigger so you can get your tattoo that you've always wanted. Yeah, get, get it on my arm, you know, like, how's it to hell? Because I could probably get so, that yeah. now. Uh, anyway. Um, <laughs> I believe in your soul. I believe in I, I, I didn't say what, 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 what print I'd be getting. I'd get a little the Robin Redbreast. Uh, <laughs> that's that's, that's, that's uh, Yes. But when you work out, it's going to turn into an eagle. You see, so it oh, no, I like that. I like your thinking. Yeah, I yeah, don't work out. Like, Can't work out. Get in the gym. Don't like, work out. Then, it was yeah. this, <laughs> no. this weird joke where this lady got a leopard like on top of her boob, like oh. a, a leopard tattoo. And of course, when she turned eighty, you know, they were a little, little bit lower to turn into a giraffe. <laughs> 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 oh that. no that's brilliant it works. It works. oh <laughs> wonderful enduring image that was yes yes you you are welcome <laughs> um, so yes do you do that a lot the uh, uh the like singing or the going to see the, the animals as you say you're an animal enthusiast uh, do you do that often um uh, unfortunately not um okay. Uh, yeah, um, as I'm sure Panda will know, South Africa is not the safest place to uh, walk around. Right. Not safe at all. It's a probably they say there's this one place in South Africa called Hillbrow, it's in Johannesburg. It's the most dangerous place in Africa, guaranteed. Um, and unfortunately, with my work, I actually have to travel there every day. Oh, it sucks. Right. I see. Um, yeah, but apart from that, like, there's a lot to do, but people are just too scared to go out genuinely it's not fun but uh 
yeah, it's dangerous. The highest crime rate, highest hijackings, carjackings, break ins. Yeah, I remember there was a time stuff. we were actually quite worried about you for a while. Yeah, I remember oh, yes. that as well. Yes. yes. Yeah. And, yeah, xenophobia. So it was like all the. Because in South Africa, we get a lot of like people from Zimbabwe and Malawi and all that coming into South Africa illegally. And the, the Zulu king said, no, they must all go. And everyone took that literally and started beating up all the foreigners. I actually saw it happen. It's not a pretty sight. And then the king had to apologize. And I didn't mean it like that. I mean, send them off gently into the night, you know, without eating them. That was, that was terrifying. And then we had the looting. I think that actually made international headlines. I yeah, think Dubai, yeah. it's a building in Dubai. They actually had the South African flag on the Dubai building um, oh. as to say, you know, we're thinking of you because yeah. it was just that bad. The looting was scary. That was petrifying, to be honest. <laughs> crazy, crazy. Um, yeah. But you still find time to barbecue. Oh, of course. Yeah. And just to let you know, and uh, someone. Always time to barbecue. Let's not call them. Fucking barbecue. It's called a braai, my friend. A b- ah. Panda. Okay. Interesting. Am I right? It's a braai. Braai. Right? Braai. Okay. B R A A I, but you got a. You got a. Oh, roll no. Oh, I can't do that. <laughs> I can't roll arse, it's become infamous here. Tr- I, oh, oh, brr. Brr. Right, what is it? What is it? Brr, I. Brr, 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 but not that one. Bry! Oh, fuck, no, I just scared myself. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, you can uh, say bry, it's fine. Bry. I'm British, let me say it without the wrong. <laughs> so, okay, it's fine then. It's all good. You actually did yeah. roll your R for a split second. I so. no, it's it's the, 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 I am not I can't, I can't. 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 Uh, that's that's it. What, what makes it? Why why the different name? What's so? Uh, it's just I suppose. <clears throat> like if you look at a car, you got the uh, the trunk. We call it the boot. Oh, we call it the boot. Uh, yeah, yeah. We call yeah. it the boot. The, the the red traffic lights. We call them robots. Hey. Okay, yeah, we don't have that. Yet. <laughs> that's robots. fucked up. It's it's messed up. It's like oh, but look, it's a red light. You got to better stop at the robot. I actually knew that. <laughs> I knew that because of a band. Yeah. The only reason I knew that. <laughs> Which band? Uh, fuck, what are they called? Um, Do you know what two of them? Yeah, it is. Die Antwort, which oh. means the answer, <laughs> if you translate it. And knew it. Fucking knew it. Die Antwort, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the only reason I knew that was because of Die Antwort. <laughs> Die Antwort. <laughs> Say it properly. Die no. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we call them here, Die Antwort. Um, but yeah, no, that's the only reason I knew why that was called that. <laughs> yeah, I think it just depends on where you are. We just call it braai because it sounds lekker, it sounds nice, it rolls off the tongue. Braai. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, now, yes, one, <laughs> trying. one of the things uh, that, you, uh, that you do, and you did yesterday, and I love watching you do, is your artwork. Um, oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. Um, can you explain your, your, your approach to, to your art on stream uh, for those unfamiliar? Okay. Uh, I've heard like art to... for a second, not art. So let's just oh, both get for, there. Either or. Both, both, both for a work. <laughs> both for a ask, please. Wait, are we talking about art or art? I can't recall. Art. Art. I need to make sure I get it right this next conversation. <laughs> art. Art with a T. Oh, with a T yeah, at the end. Okay, yeah. okay, okay yeah. Great, yeah. perfect. Okay, let me just well, try to pick that up. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, so basically, I just like to. I've always loved drawing since I was. I think I was born with a pencil in my hand. I absolutely love drawing. Um, I drew my whole childhood, and then I just stopped. Boom! I absolutely mm-hmm. stopped. And then I never went into digital ever because I always thought pencil and eraser or charcoal is the way to go. It's still one of my favorite ways to draw. Mm-hmm. Um, but then I thought, you know what, everyone's going to digital and I really want to show people how I draw because I draw quite uniquely. I mean, I'm sure you've seen the pictures 
um, are basically in a way, um, I'm going to put like, uh, what's the word, like trace mm -hmm. the eyes and all that, but color it in in my own way. I always add something to it. I'll make yeah. the eyes bigger, I'll turn it more into an anime style or into a more cyborg style, like a robotic thing. Mm -hmm. So I like to do that because I try and get as realistic to the person's facial features as possible, but then add my own twist to it. So, yeah. um, so there's this one person, her name is actually um, Vampress. So there's this one picture of her, she's, she's basically doing mm -hmm. this. So I drew it, but I added like vampire teeth, for example, right. and then the background added something else. Um, someone else was called uh, Mama Succubus. You know what a succubus is? So that I added devil wings right? and horns on the picture, yeah. <laughs> so I always add something to it just to give it a unique flavor. Yeah. That's what I enjoy doing. And I did that on a stream, and I did it for about one or two weeks, mm -hmm. like straight, only streaming. And I actually got quite good, and then I stopped for about a year. Yeah, you did, yeah. I just <laughs> pretty much like every um, single stream of, you did on that. You yeah, were perfect yeah, time. Yeah, I, I came in and watched it. Yeah. I, if, like I said, before work, I could just sit there and just watch you get these lines just meticulously right but i loved it because what yes. you were creating was just amazing I, um, I loved it and the thing is now i stopped but now i'm getting back into it again so i'm definitely really going to do more that. streams i mean i've got pictures of so many people i always tell them send, send me a selfie you're gonna be here if you want to be anonymous you're gonna stay anonymous and i've never ever if someone wants to be anonymous i've never ever told them who they are like i am very very strict on stuff like that so a random person could join the Discord and then message me in in Discord with a picture of themselves and be like, just keep me anonymous. I'll be like, fine. I'll be like, hey, this is from someone who wanted to be drawn. And people beg and plead, who is it? I'm like, not telling you. <laughs> Off, you know? Mm -hmm. I don't I, uh, like to do I that. gave I mean, you many options. Trust. I've given you many options. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's that one that you went for. But yeah. it, 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 he said, oh, I love the piss one. one. And I was like, no, 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 that's up yours. Yeah. It's, it's yeah, basically like, a yeah, big yeah, yeah. But it's literally like peace off. It's yeah, fine. Peace off. Peace, I like that. Yeah, peace off. off. Yeah. <laughs> so look forward to that so coming yeah, up. Um, I'm sure that's going to yes, be wonderful. That's actually um, coming up to what's the name? Uh, Sunday. So it's actually tomorrow. I'm doing hey! a day on stream. Nice. So, love yeah. it. Love it. Brilliant. I'm going to be doing that. Yep. And um, I'm I get a message from you like every time you do an art stream asking for yes. A really yeah, I know. You always <laughs> say no, but hey, you, you got to try your luck. Seriously, you got to try. Um, <laughs> Hey, you, you, I'm, I'm determined. Then. Yeah, you see, you see, there's the maybe. You got you determination. <laughs> you see, maybe but one. like, um, I actually got in contact with someone because um, I support South African. Uh, it's called SADAG, which is South African Depression and Anxiety Group. Um, like depression, anxiety, obviously, with a lot of people, you actually don't realize how many people suffer with that stuff, especially when you're on Twitch. When you look at their little tags, you see depression, you see anxiety, ADHD. I suffer from that kind of stuff, but I never show it. Like you would never have guessed I'm a depressed guy or I'm, I'm anxious or anything like that. Um, <clears throat> like I hide it very well through gaming, you know. Um, but I support them with what they do because they're the only place that does it in South Africa. So I've done a charity stream for them as well. Oh. And I actually got hold of them and they want me to draw one of our South African rugby players, which is quite a big thing. And he actually wants to be involved in it as well. So that's actually quite impressive for me. Um, I'm very happy it's about that. Cool. Mm -hmm. yeah. So yeah, so hopefully I can do a decent job and then he yeah. uses it, puts it on his Twitter or his nice. Instagram or whatever, but literally want to give it to him and be like, here we go, that's yeah. yours. That's great. That's, that's, so, just yeah. pos that's positive. That's, that's mm. just putting something out there that's yeah. great vibes. I love that. Uh, you're, you're right. Yeah, um, I, I've never looked into the tags or anything, uh, but I'm, mm. I'm usually quite open about my history with depression. Um, mm. because it, for me, it's not a taboo subject. I think I think the more you give it some kind of hold, the more powerful it gets. Mm. So uh, I think yeah. I, I find breaking down that barrier uh, it, it weakens its hold over me a little bit. Uh, yeah. I agree. I agree. I think the more open you are about it, the um, oh, easier it is. We have got a raid. <laughs> Another raid. We got a raid. Cheers. It's Numa oh. guy. Hello, Numa. How are you doing? Welcome in. Welcome in. Hey, midnight. How are you doing, man? My drink is finished. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> it is a refill. Yeah, I'm at a refill. Um, Holy, welcome I've in. Got a welcome in. How oh. was your stream? My drink's here? finished. Oh no. Uh, oh wait, hang on. Mine. Whoops. Wait, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Numa, how are you doing? You have papers, please. Yes, you were. How, how, how many lives did you ruin? 
Uh, and how how strong are you? How stubborn are you on your decisions being final? Uh, <laughs> uh, welcome in everyone. Um, I, as you know, I'm Sel. Uh, we are we are here at the Sun Dried Bunnings podcast uh, with my co-host tonight, uh, Harley, and our very special guest, Potatosaurus Rex. Um, did, did I roll the R then? I don't think I did. Um, no, I, I don't tried. Think. I tried. Um, we did earlier. We need to let like, somebody didn't didn't clip it, okay? And that's terrible that nobody clipped that. We need many, to go back and clip it. Many <laughs> not his problem situations. Oh, I see. I, I tipped all bribes and then arrest them. Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> no, doesn't surprise me. Doesn't surprise. <laughs> I'm glad you had a fun time though. Uh, oh, yeah, we had a fun time. Yeah, she just said that. Uh, denying people in my beautiful country. That's <laughs> your beautiful country was it i thought you just weren't passport control um there we go uh, <laughs> so we yes we are here with the wonderful uh of Tate Soros rex uh, just tell us about his uh, very distinct uh art streams um something yeah. i've never seen before is the is the way that you layer and then trace over i've not seen that anyone yes. else do that but it creates no. such wonderful uh things but they're not even caricatures in a way mm-hmm. like you do actually add stuff to them but they're not like um, that they are as big eyes or big nose yeah. or yeah, exactly. I don't exaggerate features no. basically. Yeah. Yeah, Sometimes I, I do with the eyes depending on the, what the picture's doing, you right. know, just to kind of like if, if someone's like got their big eyes, I just make them a little bit just bigger, exemplify. To add a bit to it, yeah. yeah, but not by much. I don't make it like proper anime like from no. forehead to cheekbones, jawline <laughs> type of thing, so yeah, yeah, uh, keep it in proportion a bit, yes, absolutely, absolutely. Uh, <laughs> Uh, that's, uh, uh, it's been absolutely it's been a one it's been wonderful um now i was going to ask you a show and tell at this point but first of all i want to talk about your name change that you had um because you went ah. from the roast potato to potatosaurus yes. uh rex which rex. um i i i've got to say potatosaurus rex i think actually given the conversations we've had then the cut subjects we cut Covered, kind of up a little bit more beautifully. How'd that's that come about? The exact reason why. why. <laughs> okay. oh, okay. I love dinosaurs. I like, I like the name. I like the name change. I love dinosaurs and pirates. Dinosaurs and pirates that we are. Right. Yeah, so when when, when I saw you change the name. When are you going to get a Sea of Thieves, Holly? Oh, when I have a computer that will run it. I've been saying this to you for a year, right? She could better get a shopping to get it. Them 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 them. We've, been try- we've been trying to convince Harley to get Sea of Thieves. Berserk and myself have been non stop, and then we literally just gave up. But now I think I'm going to rekindle that. And <laughs> <laughs> she's going to let about it. She has mentioned okay. Sea of Thieves on a number of occasions. Right? Yeah, cool. yeah, yeah. I, I have mentioned Sea of Thieves a few times. I have a graphics card and a motherboard, okay? I'm on my way to building a PC. <laughs> you'll get there. You'll get there. Don't I'll worry. I believe you. Absolutely good, good point there, Numa. Dino and Pirates both go R. They're basically the same. Absolutely. Yeah, see, right. Right. Okay. See the turtles. Okay. See the turtles. See the turtles. Do you fear death? I love him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This is what I heard the first time I went into a roast potato stream. Was, do you what? fear death? Oh fuck! I love it. It's my favorite <laughs> line from Pirates of the Caribbean of any of them. Sea Not turtles. To come to yeah, the sea turtles and the Davy Jones line. I'm gonna. I'm and gonna... then I joined his Discord and we watched Pirates of the Caribbean. Did you really? While I was. Yeah. yeah we watched <laughs> yeah. It. I got to know like your holidays like that. For help coming in and watching films with me, actually, as well, in the Discord. That's right. Yes. And I'm yes. Like, drop in on our movie nights, yeah. Now, I'm going to do an impression now of oh. Barbosa from Pirates of the Caribbean. All right, the first one. Are you ready? All right. Go for uh-huh, it. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You better start believing in ghost stories, Miss Turner. Because you're in one! There you I go. love it. Oh. So you should have put the beard on before you did that. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, that beard I originally got to do an impression of Numa guy. That's true. Uh, was, uh... You wear the mask. And then he says, yeah. you know, like, um, what the ghost story? And he's like, you're in one? And we say, in one, Jack, you're in one. Should I do it? I'll do it. I've adopted it numerous times. I love those movies. I love, I love those movies <laughs> so much. Yeah, don't you remember? I got it for a uh, Soul Fest last year. Um, <laughs> I love it. So, uh, right, here we go. Remember when you, when you say you're in, well, I'm going to lift the mouth yeah. up. Yeah. 
We're going to get into character. Obviously, it's me now. Hello, it's me. It's Sol. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, there's I'm bald. Oh, hang on. I'm bald. Where'd you go? Right. Where did oh, Sol go? Okay. Sol, where hello. did you go? Bald is here. I'm scared. <laughs> right. Right. You still can't. Right. You want me to do an impression of of uh, of that manly man from Pirates of Caribbean? Oh, God. Right. Hey. Hey, All right. Here we go. All right. <laughs> Here we go, here we go, are you ready? You ready everyone? Right. You better start believing in ghost stories, Miss Turner! Cause you're in one! <laughs> that was my impression of that bad boss fella. Oh god, I love it. And I'm back in the room. Well done. Um... Well done. That was brilliant. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, sure. Got to see that. Oh, honey, are you okay there? <laughs> <laughs> She's dying, dude. I think you killed her. Oh, well, <laughs> they do say I slay on occasion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> oh, she's alright. Oh, I'm God, crying. I think Holly's got to make you stop working. Jesus. Yeah, that's exactly what's happening. That's exactly what happened. I need to get a loading thing to come up on my screen. And it says that. <laughs> that was good though. I love that. I put the beard on. Potatoes yeah, really like, Numa, how'd you get on Soul Stream so quickly and why did you sound like Soul? So cool, mate. Soul is a tight show. You're damn right, are they? <laughs> uh, she here out there with a 10 out of 10. Uh, she missed out the wood bang, but there you go. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I don't know, he's very manly. Um, I fixed it. <laughs> so, there we go. <laughs> uh, <laughs> ten out of ten would probably run away as well. <laughs> yeah, I would absolutely. Um, but uh, we mentioned your name change, Potato Reflect. I think it does fit you yes. perfectly. You mentioned before we started streaming your, uh, your wonderful t shirt. Um, I think we should uh, bring that up. The what you've got there. Oh, the t-shirt is so good. I think yeah. it's so cute. Yeah, uh, very distinct. <laughs> um, um, hang on, you got to jog my memory. The t-shirt. T yeah, that you're wearing. <laughs> oh, the t-shirt. Yeah. Oh, wait, what, what, what did I say? Yeah, your t-shirt. Your oh, this. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. You show this before stream. <laughs> there you go. There wonderful, you go. wonderful. I wanted to bring that up before Sorry, you actually... you had one drink. Okay, come on now. Uh, actually, no, I actually haven't. I've had plenty more before yeah. I got here. Oh, oh, we've got, we got a clip that... now of Barbosol. Soul. Um... I can't. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> I'm just going to do nothing but rewatch that clip. That's my day now. So, um... <laughs> So, um, so yes, uh, you did show us uh, something before we started here, and I think we want to share mm. it with the world in uh, our little show and tell section. Please uh, fascinate us with what you Drum have. Roll. Drum roll. Check this out. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Way! Look at that potato, your favourite, that Yoda fella. Um, yes, I forgot yeah. his name though. What's his name again? Grogu. 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 Yeah. Grogu. Grogu. Yes. Grogu. Yes, this is actually crocheted yeah. from scratch. Crocheted from him. from London. I don't know if you've heard of that place before. Oh, uh, no, I know, I heard it smells. It smells <laughs> somewhere in the Maldives, yeah, Hawaii yeah. or something. Uh, yeah, it was actually crocheted <laughs> from scratch and sent over to me. Um, Skylar. There we go. Skylar. Oh. So, yeah, for short, yeah. Actually crocheted this and sent it over. I am so proud of it. It's so fluffy and squishy. Yeah. It's so cute. I <laughs> want one. Like... Mine. Mm -hmm. Could cross it all. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> <I'm getting there. laughs> yeah. So it's quite cool. I mean, it's got okay. Yeah. Literally, it's 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 you've got the whole jacket thing and everything. Okay, like it's not just one piece. It's literally a jacket you can it's... take off. Oh, that's one. Oh, I like really? that. I like it. Got attachments. Yeah. So that's cool. Gonna... Drink, Wait, so we could get naked one. We could get a naked one. Give us a shrimp tease. What's happening? Uh, <laughs> Come on, take it off. Take it off. Come says London, head e off. London equals sewers. I'm pretty sure there's sewers yeah, everywhere yeah. now. I mean, that's <laughs> the way we felt. Yeah, I'm sure. Oh, 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 what do you mean we're making you? Yo, 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 yo
<laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Look at that! We yes. promised you to eat tonight. Put it back on. I told you not to do that. Sorry, <laughs> <laughs> excuse me. No, that's, that's understandable. I've had, I've had plenty of fights with mine as well. Keep it on. Uh, She's so disappointed in you. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what I'm talking about. So much better. There we go. All oh dressed up God. and ready to rock and roll. <clears throat> oh, yeah, the Hulk. Mm -hmm. I didn't. Oh, God, I didn't see it. <laughs> that is cool. <laughs> He gives me, he gives me so much trouble. so long to yeah. realise it was there. I had a fight with him the other day, just because he wouldn't sit still. Um, so, it's, it happens, it happens. Uh, Eva comes on here, Eva, you two have a love -hate Eva relationship. fights me or kisses me every time, and it's, it's you know, unbelievable. Well, it's but, adorable. Oh, peck me. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> just quit it. Yeah, I'll so, stab at you. <laughs> you know, it's because I have to keep well, on this brain to prop him up sometimes, so he gets a bit... You know, it gets a bit frisky <laughs> sometimes, yeah. Oh, no, not now, not on yeah. camera. Oh, whoa, 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 yeah. whoa please. Uh, <laughs> I can see that. Put him down. So, uh... Okay, hang on, just really quick. This, this, this literally just started going... <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, yeah, it always but happens. it's been it's worth been, every yeah. second. Uh, <laughs> um, you actually oh, have something yeah. else. You have something else you want to show us as well. Do you want to show that as well? I think it's just there. I can't the... do that on stream. No, not that. Yeah. Um, God. Check, check that, this out. Check this thing out. Look at it. Yes. Look at that. You guys should know. You guys should know where this is from. Look at the symbol. I love him. Yes, yeah. that's from thing. the game. Yeah, that game. Yeah, the thing. With the, yeah, the thing. Is it the one I've yet to play, hey. even though it's been out for ten years? Come on. So, uh, Hang on, it came out on the 11th of the 11th, 2011. Who is it? Dragon. Dragon. Knows who it is. Dragon. <laughs> What's its name? I think it is. Um, uh, Randall. <laughs> that was actually a damn good guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <wait. laughs> oh man, I love this thing. I've had it since then. Oh man, it was from the game called. Skyrim? Shuda. I was. It? it is the one that I haven't played in ever since it came out. <laughs> yeah. I, I've played Oblivion. I've never played Skyrim before. Oblivion, though, was Skyrim. a good game. Yeah, Oblivion, Oblivion was Oblivion. amazing. I don't know why I've never played Skyrim. I think it's just because of how big it is that I've never been able to kind of... Like, it took me six months to beat The Witcher. <laughs> that's when I wasn't... Yeah, uh, well, it's it a game I've never played. Oh, there you go. Well, the yeah, Witcher, yeah. I, I played The Witcher three. I like The Witcher three. Yeah, the Witcher, and Witcher they say The Witcher three is. They say The Witcher three is the best game ever made. But I don't believe that. I believe the come from. <laughs> campaign from Red Dead Redemption is brilliant. <laughs> it's sitting, he's like sitting in his lap. Oh, I see. You just suddenly like waving a dinosaur around. <laughs> come from. <laughs> It's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm going to make a point I, now. Okay, on. My weight I use this one. It looks dodgy already. So if I do that, <laughs> let's not do that again. Oh, dear. Let's <laughs> next oh, level. He always has dinosaurs in his lap, okay? Yes, I even <laughs> got toothless. I even got toothless, yeah. I've got it. I I've love toothless. Oh, He's there, so cute. Hey, there he is. I don't know if it's... Focusing, but yeah, got little. He's so cute. He sits on He looks like an axolotl dinosaur. It looks like an axolotl dragon. Thank you, guys. He's not fighting now. Why does he keep calling out stuff just out of nowhere? It's crazy. To have stuff with you. It's as bad as you, so. I've got a Look at that venom or something. What else have I got yet? Well, I'm not showing you that. <laughs> what? Nothing. Carry on. Yes, you were. <laughs> it's just props I use. It's just props. Don't worry. <laughs> we've all got them. We've all got them. Uh, he's madder than so. Nobody go... is madder than so. Uh, okay? <laughs> <laughs> he has well, to love it. Oh, there we go. Well done, Ollie. Yeah, you're not straight in there. Um, <laughs> yeah, fight me, so. Yes. So, um. <laughs> not again. What? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what is what is your plans for the future now? Uh, as you, as you grow, because I I do know that you kind of went 
over to YouTube for a bit and you've now come back over to uh, Twitch. I don't know, are you still yeah. trying to find your platform or what, what, where are you, where are you uh, headed? I think honestly, Twitch is still the platform for what Excellent. we do, you mm -hmm. know, as streamers. YouTube, yes, it's good, but you trying to get recognized or find the right algorithm and all that is very difficult. Yeah. I mean, there's other streaming services out there, but like this is one you have to pay a subscription just to stream. You should be right. streaming for people for free, literally. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know why they do it. Um, <laughs> so yeah, it's it's me. I, I'm sticking with stream, uh, with Twitch. Oops. Um, mm -hmm. I don't know, but it's it's weird because recently now with me doing the Red Dead stuff with the role play, I've noticed more people have joined than before, which is oh, weird. Okay. I mean, at the moment, I'm on the road to a thousand followers. You I are. have yes. yes, I am. You yes, are. I have. God, what number is that? I have 88 left to reach a thousand. So I'm pushing that. I only need 88 people. It's in, I actually can't believe it. It's yeah. mind blowing. And, and I, I've never Twitch, seen someone like two that. years. And I believe you got affiliate quite quickly. Um, yes, I did. Well. You know, it's yeah. because of sheep, and then obviously fairy stayed, um, mm -hmm. berserk stayed, a couple of other guys stayed, uh, soldier stayed as well, and they've always just helped me. Mm -hmm. They've always every time I've been on, they've been sitting there. And that's what got me my three views and obviously Excellent. with being raided from a big streamer that helped boost the numbers very quickly mm -hmm. so it did help it really did yeah, yeah that's, that's fantastic um and <laughs> yeah so uh, you're gonna stick with the role play because i think that it's it's great to see and i'm, I'm guessing occasionally some art streams as well like tomorrow um, oh 100 yeah. <laughs> so tomorrow's an art stream yeah be there, so I'll yeah, make sure well, I'm, I'm going to be there in two ways, hopefully. So, because uh, you, <laughs> you have my picture there, and you also have, yeah. uh, you also have, oh, I'll be there too. Why not? Uh, yeah, <laughs> I, want this. I want to see this. Uh, yeah. well, I want to see this. I'm hoping that it's on at a time that I can be there. Oh no, no. Um, so, um, <laughs> it's nice. we're so it's cruel. Not. We're so cruel to. Her. We have to be. <laughs> no, we are. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they don't get to see what happens. But she don't, they don't get to see what happens in her DMs when she's so vicious to us, you know, and rude. Yeah. Oh yeah, so I'm so vicious. Yeah. 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 Extremely, <laughs> it's scary. Uh, yeah, but also like the horror games as well. Oh like, yes. So just yeah. two seconds, and I saw. Like, obviously, when I first raided Harley, her background I remember had the red roses and the black thorns as far as I can recall yeah All right. yeah the my yeah. first little thing mm -hmm. overlay yeah so that overlay um obviously grew to what it is now and you just got more and more into horrors because I think we did speak about horrors on the few times that I was in your stream yeah and I yeah, still yeah. recommend you just do horrors because I think <clears throat> your horror ways like like the, the way the stream looks like your 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 character your avatar just the the setup i think you are a horror based person mm -hmm. you know I what i mean right. I so. scary, <laughs> or sometimes you are scary but apart from that i think you can I'll say it. let's face it i am a little scared <laughs> just just a tad freaking <laughs> scared me to hell yeah. i think i left that disc um okay let's not talk about that one <laughs> um <laughs> It's not good. It's uh, one time. Okay. Uh, <laughs> awkward anyway. silence. So, so what are you doing? Are you, are you, I'm going to go farm in my eye, you know? Oh, 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 yeah. I, 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 actually gave, I actually gave Harley her name as well. Horror he, Queen did, Harley. he did. He um, did. He did. We were it, discussing um, my no horror. Ways. Yeah, because oh, I, I agree with you. I think uh, going down the horror horror route was was favourable. And she wanted to leave the mm. Abe's Odyssey behind. So um, fucking Abe. <laughs> Abe. Yeah, she always yeah, talking about Abe. Bastard can yeah. live in Rockstar Farm. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, he only wants you to, uh, you know, follow me. That's all he, all he wanted. That's no, all Abe wanted. No, we are not. We're not even. We're not going to talk about that. Okay. okay let's <laughs> not talk about the <laughs> I actually sent uh, a text was a list of uh, horror games. Um, yes. Because yeah. you wanted to, you I wanted to delve to into, into them. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. 
because uh, I, I absolutely love the Panda. Panda. jump true, scares Panda. that we have and the jump scares in the game. So it always adds an extra bit of fear yeah. in the game. I mean, the, the one Visage video I did, I had over 100 jump scares and I had to literally edit to where the jump scares were just to fit them into an hour long video. Uh, right. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? That was insane. Oof, I was a scary son of a bitch. I'm gonna tell you that much because I you was are a jumpy bitch. You stuff. really are. I call Soul a jumpy bitch all the time, but you are the jumpiest. Yeah, I, I, Jesus, I don't laugh. You made me jump. I get <laughs> jump scared by things that don't necessarily are designed to be jump scares. That's the oh, issue. Like extenders. It. There, there yeah. is a there's a quote from the sitcom Alan Partridge where he he's going mm -hmm. around a tour of a house and he pulls at a table and it extends and as he does it he goes yes it's an extender that's all it is that's mm -hmm. a sound alert because it's just a nice like but it gets me every time it Shit makes it scares you because it's got the it's got the noise <laughs> of the table and then him saying yes. it. so yeah. it, it just gets me every, a meatloaf mm. and now westy he's adopted minions that do it to me it's oh, uh, oh but no. as long as everyone's happy fun and me april's still ticking I don't know. I, I, <laughs> I don't know. We thought we were going to lose you a couple of times. So. <laughs> I, they, I always, always find Forget. ways for them to mess with me. That's the way better. As long as it's good time. Yeah. Yes, it's an extender. I Big potato just did it. <laughs> you. <laughs> but how dare you, potato? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, it costs them 50 bits every time, so <laughs> thank you, but... It's um, a potato. You see, potatoes, we work together. Was yeah, I knew it was In the mind, do it. And yeah. potato did it. See, potatoes. potatoes. <laughs> well... That's how we roll. Ladies and gentlemen. Okay, now somebody has to go and scare you now. <laughs> no, that's true. Uh, yeah. I've taken my alerts off. Yeah, oh, he's been easy. A clever fella, yeah. Oh, he hasn't. Um, His sound alerts are still on for bits. Wait for this... No. Potatoes unite. <laughs> Then does potatoes yeah, have any in know. it or not? Uh, like, when yeah. you when you uh, make it more than one, I forgot the word. Yeah. You have that. Yeah. And then it says potatoes. That is confusing. Is it a potato pie? We're cheering a great Because the problem is when I see potatoes written with an E, I see pota toes. Pota toes. Pota toes. Pota toes. toes. I yeah. wonder if that's how you actually pronounce it. Potatoes. I think it is, yeah, I think it is potatoes Potato. with an E, but for some reason I feel like I see it more now, and I don't Potatoes. Know why. Or maybe it's because Potatoes. it's so many people's names that when I'm, like, apostrophe yes in it, I'm seeing mm. it without the E, and that's just stuck. Uh, but yeah, okay. so many potatoes yeah, yeah. everywhere. But only one, so... Oh, everywhere. I was the original, though. I was the original. You were, oh, <laughs> mate, thank you. Well, you potato. Potato has been around for a year and a month. You've, you've been two years, so you have got them outdated, I think, for the most part. Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> Did you just call him yeah. old? I feel like you just called him old. Like... <laughs> no. No, I didn't. I didn't Who's that? I'm not old. See? <laughs> not old. He, when he uses his real voice, he doesn't sound old. <laughs> 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 the girl voice. Shut up. Sorry, I had a moment. <laughs> <laughs> I, can you imagine like, old, now. us all old streaming? Like, I would be, I'd be like, oh, hello, welcome to the stream. Um, I'm here with Potatosaurus Rex. How you doing? Who said that? <laughs> <laughs> so I have to, I have to <laughs> speak up on the mic. Yeah, but Harley would exactly the same. Yeah, she yeah. Would the same. I was going to say. Exactly the same. <laughs> Literally like that. <laughs> Talk the same, young. everything. Um, forever young. <laughs> forever young. Jesus. Um. Yeah. Moving on. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> we um. We have we have come to the end of the Sunshine Bunnies podcast and. Um, it, it leaves me only to say thank you so much, Protectosaurus Rex, for being our guest here, our 22nd guest, as we noted earlier. Uh, you have quite a, a, a affiliation yes. with that number. Um, yes, I do. Yes, I do. <laughs> so, uh, Protectosaurus Rex, <laughs> because if you follow him, yes, thank you very much, because he's amazing. He does art, he does role play. If you've never seen a role play stream, I don't think there's any better avenue to get into it than 
viewing it through the spectrum of Tetris Rex because that's how I've done it and I am fascinated by it I'm always intrigued when he's doing the role play um, it's something that it, it it's you know I've always said that this this um, tap platform and I like uh, the fact television television sort of dying but there's no reason we can't adapt some of the television aspects into what we're doing and I feel like role playing it's like watching a soap opera uh, in a video game form. You are watching people go about their normal day's li lives and you yeah, create the drama for you through that role play aspect. So you get the kind of streaming experience, but you can also sit back and you can watch a show being performed using the game. And I think Tetris does it amazingly. So um, uh, there you go. Uh, so that's all right. Bro, this is not a drama. <laughs> Rufy is not a drama. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. But that's a different story. He's in love, by the way. Incredible acting in his voice. What? Maybe uh, line up, but uh, she doesn't know it yet. <laughs> <laughs> it's all in character. I love it. Ruby. <laughs> brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Um, I also want to thank Harley oh. for being my co-host tonight. You did wonderful. Oh, yes. welcome. Thank you Looking for having me. Up. And I can't believe you brought that blasted bird along as well. You leave obsidian out of this, all right? She's amazing. Make it off the screen. Sus. Yeah. Uh, Sus. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Gideon thank, is adorable. Thank you so much uh, for joining us here, Potentious Rex and Harley. Thank you so much, uh, ladies and gentlemen. I will be playing uh, Life Be Strange in just a few minutes. We're going to um, wrap up the, uh, the first series. We've got two episodes uh, to do with that, um, so stay with us. We'll be moving on to that. But yes, thank you so much. This podcast will be going up on YouTube and delivered to you, um, so it will live on forevermore. Um, oh no! Yes, I mean also. <laughs> I forgot to mention that whatever you did here <laughs> would live on. Um, yeah. Can you blow my face? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna mess with it. Don't you worry. <laughs> Um, oh, no, no. No, thank you, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, I really do appreciate You're it. And everyone welcome. over there uh, on on Texas Rex, so thank you so much for joining us. I hope you had a fantastic time. Um, I hope you enjoyed my sorry face, but I know you've loved Harley's, so that's the main thing. Aww. <laughs> oh, damn it! Oh, they've got used to yours. They've got used to yours over there. Uh, I'm, I'm it's what they it's what they come <laughs> for in both ways. So. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to leave you with that. So, <laughs> thank you so much. Um, I'm going to sign off now. Um, farewell. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. I'm going to leave the VC. Farewell, guys. Thank you. Uh, and farewell. Bye, guys. Stay tuned, guys. You'll carry on hearing me here on Stream Hello. Well. Farewell. Farewell. Bye. Bye. Bye.